Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 8 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about create user profile. So let's see how can we create user profile. First of all, let's create a model and migration for profile. So switch to the command prompt and uh, for creating the model, just type here the command php artisan make colon model space model name which is profile and for creating the migration just add your task m now press enter model and migration created now switch to the project and let's open the migration so just go inside the database directory then migration and from here let's open this one create profile table migration and inside this migration let's add here some column so first add here dollar table arrow uh, data type big integer and uh, column name user underscore id and also add here the unsigned and the label uh, only unsigned okay now another uh, column which is table data type string and column name image uh, for user profile image okay and uh, inside this column set here the null label all right now let's copy this and uh, paste here multiple time and now change the column inside this just write here mobile then uh, for address line one and line two city province country and zip code and zip code okay now set here the foreign key so for that just write here down the table arrow foreign this one then add here the column name which is user underscore id all right and add here the references with column id on user table okay on users table and also add here the on delete cascade all right now save this file and uh, now let's open the user model so just go inside the app directory then uh, models and from here let's open this one user.php okay and inside this model let's create a function after this so right here public function and function name profile and inside this just return here return dollar this arrow has one and add here the class user sorry profile 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 colon colon class okay and also add here the column name user underscore id All right now save this file and uh, let's migrate this migration so switch to the command prompt and uh, uh, here for migrating the migration just type in the command php artisan migrate okay press enter now run the application so right here uh, first create here a new component okay for profile so for creating the new uh, component live wire component just type in the command php artisan make colon live wire space directory name user slash component name which is profile user profile okay so write here user profile component okay and now press enter Component created now run the application so write a php artisan serve all right now switch to the project 
and uh, first of all close this and now let's create the route for this component so just go inside the routes directory and then open web.php file and now inside the user middleware route group inside this group uh, let's create a new route here so write here route colon colon get add here the uri user slash profile and then add here the class name so write here user profile component colon colon class and also give here the route name so write here name user dot profile all right now save this file now let's open the class user profile component class okay so just go inside the app directory then http livewire user and from here let's open this one user profile component.php file okay and here first of all let's add here the layout so right here arrow layout and inside this just add here the folder name layouts dot base okay now inside the render method just fetch here the user so write here user equal to user colon colon find and inside this write here auth and also import here the auth like this then colon colon user id all right now just return and also import here the user model okay this one and now let's uh, pass this user to the view file so here just add comma then inside the big bracket just write here user arrow dollar user all right now save this file now let's open the user profile component of view file so just go inside the resources directory then views live wire user and from here let's open this one user profile component dot blade dot php file okay now here just remove this comment and uh, first add here the container so right here container and also set here this style adding uh, 30 pixel top and bottom and left right zero and inside this container let's add here the row then add here the panel panel default all right the panel uh, heading panel heading and inside this heading just write here the title profile then panel body okay and inside this uh, let's add here the two column called md8 uh, 4 and uh, call md8 okay inside this just uh, display here the user profile image so for that uh, first of all add here the if condition if dollar user arrow profile arrow image then add here the image tag src is equal to and add here the path of the user profile image so first of all let's create a folder inside the public directory okay so we'll go to the project and uh, inside the public directory uh, let's open the assets images and inside the images directory let's create a new folder here so new new folder and uh, write here the name profile all right now let's add uh, this path uh, assets images and profile okay so inside this just write here asset then asset uh, assets slash images slash profile 
okay and after this big uh, curly bracket add your forward slash and then user arrow profile arrow image okay and uh, set here the width image width 100 percent okay now close this tag if uh, profile image is not available of uh, user then uh, display here the uh, default image so for that just add here the else and inside this else part uh, let's copy this and paste here okay and just close here the if directory so right here in if and inside the default image just remove this and uh, let's download a default dummy image profile image so uh, switch to the browser and go to the google and here just to search profile dummy image okay and uh, from here you can download any dummy image uh, for the profile i have already downloaded so let's copy this dummy image default image okay and uh, go inside the profile directory and just paste here okay now let's copy this image name and uh, go to the project and here after this just add your forward slash and paste here the image name okay default dot zpg now here inside this column let's display here the user mobile number email uh, name and address okay so first add here the e tag then b tag and inside this is the label name and uh, here just to display the name so right here dollar user arrow name now let's copy this and paste here now change here the text email then phone for displaying the email just write here the user arrow email and for phone number phone profile arrow mobile okay now add here the hr tag and uh, after this just uh, display here the address so let's copy this and paste here all right now change here the label for address line one line two and then city province country and then zip code okay and also change here the name column name so write here line one line two city province country and here zip code all right now save this file Now let's open the layout file and uh, let's add the link for the user profile inside the user menu. So from the resources directory, views, layouts, and from here let's open this one base.play.php file. And inside the user menu, you can see here this is the user menu. Okay, so here just before this uh, change password, after this, uh, let's copy this LI and uh, paste here and change here the title my profile okay and also change here the route name user dot profile and here profile my profile now save this file and everything is done so let's check this so switch to the browser and 
here just refresh the page Now uh, go inside the user menu and just click on my profile link. Okay, attempt to read property emails. All right, because this time the profile, inside the profile table, there is no any record. Okay, so before displaying the image or any data, let's add here a condition. Uh, do one thing uh, just to go inside the user profile component class file and uh, uh, before this uh, fetching the user uh, just uh, right here first uh, check here the user profile so write your user profile is equal to user profile uh, profile model in profile where user id user underscore id is equal to auth colon colon user id okay and uh, call it the first method if user profile um, dollar user profile is not found just added the note sign then let's create a user profile record okay so for that just write here dollar use dollar profile is equal to new profile all right now dollar profile arrow user underscore id is equal to this one Okay, and then save the profile. So right here, dollar profile arrow save method. Okay, and after this, just fetch here the user and return to the view here. Okay, now save this file and uh, let's check again. So switch to the browser and go to the user dashboard. All right now go to the my profile page and here you can see the username email and this time the phone number line 1 line 2 and this address is not available so it's showing the blank okay and this uh, you can see here the default user profile image okay because this time there is no uh, user profile image is added inside the database table okay in next video we will see how can we update uh, update this user profile so that's all about create user profile so thanks for watching this video and uh, if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching